going to be a recording of my doing the Dark Colossus. Um, these are my teams for him. I'll explain to you what I'm doing as I'm doing it. First try is going to be uh, right now. So the goal here is to just burn out the Colossus. Turn auto off because having auto on here is bad. All right, so trying to defense break to start with. If every defense break works, things are going to go well. Totally didn't proc. Okay, expose weakness attempts. Also, totally did not. Okay, because this is not starting off well at all. I didn't break defense. I didn't get a proc on my expose weakness. Neither of those worked, and they both had a really good chance to have worked, and they both failed horribly. Try again. Defense break. Not even resist. He just outright ignored it. All right. He actually does more damage. The goal for this first team is to get him under half health. And then die. Generally, tragically, is how they end up dying. I was actually trying to get the retribution on the Kiki, but apparently that wasn't going to happen. So I've had a really bad start at this fight. Generally, I would have landed a defense break by now, and I've only landed a singular exposed weakness, which is rather problematic for getting him under half health, which is where I wanted him to be. He's now under half health. He will ult, and then he's going to use his next ult on my next team when they come in. Oh, except she lived, and then she died. All right, so this team has to finish the fight, but I'm already at a huge disadvantage on this, so I don't know if it's going to work. Uh, we'll find out. Yeah, I'm, I'm just about to, to get hammered. So this fight was unfortunately, it looks like, going to be an absolute failure because I completely could not land defense breaks early, which is very much necessary. Now, I do have a defense break running on it right now. My Yuki does do really good damage. So there is a small chance I could still complete the fight, except he just healed a whole bunch. Guys are still alive, though, except for the Shelly, who's now dead. And there's no defense break running. She's been sealed. She can't defense break, and all my guys are just going to die. So, yeah. So I got completely hosed early. I did not land any defense breaks in the first two turns or exposed weaknesses. Um, and those are pretty much critical for these teams to be able to compete and finish. So there's 25 energy. Just kiss it goodbye. And the Kraken, she's trying, but she has no chance of defeating this thing by herself. Generally, this is two, one, two up and two down successes. Because I usually land a defense break, and it goes through much faster in sequence, and I don't get hosed like that. Try that again. It's not an issue with the teams. It's a question of I didn't even get a chance to proc the defense break or the exposed weakness for the first two turns. Auto off, please. All right. Try again. Defense break. Landed. Okay. That's a start. Exposed weakness. Both landed. Notice the difference in damage I just dealt based on that. A much higher amount of damage was just dealt in the first turn. All right, so I'm going to try to get her to pick up the retribution. There it goes. She has some hit points. All right, so I have, you notice the much bigger difference in damage I've dealt. He's well under half, has a three-turn defense break running on him. He only just now used his ult. I've got two guys still alive. Um, honestly, I'm just going to switch teams right now. The other team can attempt to recover some. This team is going to go in and just pummel on him. He did rub the defense break off. That's okay. I've got two other units that can put defense breaks on him. They're not sealed. There's the defense break. And he's almost dead at this point. Dominance really just doesn't matter, this fight. 
and notice how much simpler and easier that went. I landed the defense break at the onset, made a huge difference. Oh, okay, and much, look at these rewards. Two Siegfried shards, six-star gem, not a bad gem for a gem of the healer. Flat on the defense number, but not overall a bad result whatsoever for that. So far and away better than previous results I've had, and that was my best time on that. All right, so we're going to do this one again. I should be able to clear it again without an issue. Let's find out. All right, defense break initial. No, exposed weakness initial. Landed. Crits off of the Arthur. So notice again, without the double defense break exposed weakness, I'm not doing nearly as much damage, but the defense break can still function. Let's see if I can land. Nope, exposed weakness again, maybe. Okay, so I did land the exposed weakness twice, so that's good but I'm not nearly as well set up as I was last time. All right, so this time it's the Yaksha first. Resisted, followed by the Kiki, resisted, followed by everybody else. So it took him under half. The team's about to get walloped, but... Okay, so he just got healed by his side unit. Okay, we're just going to go ahead and switch teams at this point, because if I don't, they're just dead anyway. Defense break success. Some combos laid in. Retribution on the C-Star. She does have some hit points. She will get hammered pretty hard by the Retribution, though, but she'll live. And he's going to ult off on my guys. The Nike is slowly getting some health back on the other team. So the Sea Star is now dead. No, that's just not being avoided at this point. And he's going to get healed again. I don't know if I'm going to be able to out damage what's left of that heal on this turn with my seals on me. You know, I think I will actually, because the Yuki should survive. She'll get her attack off, and then the Nike will come in and should be able to back clean up. Oh, never mind. She just, the Yuki would not be denied, and she got some healing orbs out of it, so she's very happy. All right, so that was interesting. All right, so let's see what these rewards are. All right, not nearly as good as last time, no Siegfrieds, but a nice gem of the Magi. I mean, hit point boosts, that's not a bad gem at all. Some mid fruits, more mid fruits, not bad. All right, so that was my doing the Dark Colossus on Mondays.